Hello everybody, it's Fu here, and you may have noticed this week that Pokemon Home dropped, which means that you can transfer some Pokemon from previous games into Pokemon Sword and Shield. There are some really exciting things like Melmetal and Curum, but the topic of this video is way more important. We're talking about a beast, and that is Simple Swoobat. So Swoobat was in the base Pokemon Sword and Shield game, but its a hidden ability Simple was not released for some reason. It was in 5 star max raid, battle but you couldn't get its simple ability, which is a great ability that doubles any stat changes that it experiences. So today I'll be telling you four ways to capitalize on Swoobat's simple ability, because in Pokemon Sword and Shield it got a ton of new tricks, and this Pokemon is so stupidly fun to use, so I can't wait to take you through that. First, if you like this kind of content, please consider leaving a like on the video, it helps out my channel and also lets me know what you want to see more of. And also, I will be doing a Woobat with the simple ability distribution. If you want to get your hands on a simple Woobat just in time for Valentine's Day, then follow me over on Twitter. I'll either be doing it this weekend or next week, so more details on my Twitter account. So Simple Swoobat is here. How do you capitalize on this? The first way I'm going to say is use Nasty Plot. Previously, you could only use Calm Mind, which was still a great setup move for Swoobat because it boosted its special attack and special defense by two stages thanks to that simple ability. However, this Pokemon is pretty frail and even at plus two special defense it can get taken out and with plus two special attack it's still not the most powerful thing around. However, in Pokemon Sword and Shield, Swoobat got access to Nasty Plot. It never had it before. Nasty Plot normally boosts your special attack by two stages, but with Simple, it's by four stages. That actually takes Swoobat's special attack stat to ridiculous levels. Think of the most powerful special attacker, give it a choice specs, and Swoobat will be more powerful than it. It's more powerful than choice specs Curum, more powerful than choice specs Mewtwo. This thing has a ridiculous special attack stat after a nasty plot boost. On top of that, this Pokemon does keep the stored power attack, and that gets more powerful with stat boosts. After one nasty plot, it's base 100 power, automatically making it more powerful than Psychic, the next most powerful Psychic type move it might want to run, so nasty plot stored power is great on this Pokemon. As I've said, it's quite a frail Pokemon. All of its base stats are low apart from its speed, so you will need to give it a Focus Sash to survive that first turn as you go for a nasty plot, and then you can start to sweep with stored power. But that is the first way that you need to use this Pokemon. It's so fun, just one nasty plot and you're going to get going. The second thing that I want to mention is this Pokemon really benefits from Dynamaxing because although you can't use stored power after you Dynamax, it turns into Max Mindstorm, which is sometimes weaker. If you've got good stat boosts, actually Max Mindstorm can be weaker than stored power. However, you do have access to Max Airstream too, and that's great because it boosts your speed, but because of the simple ability, it actually doubles Swoobat's speed. Swoobat's speed is already great, but when it's doubled, it outspeeds everything, absolutely everything. So if you still run it on maybe the Nasty Plot set, and then you Dynamax straight away, instead of going for stored powers, you go for some Max Airstreams, not only are you getting faster, you're getting more stat boost, so if you survive your Dynamax turns, you will then have an even more powerful stored power to use, which is so cool. So those are two ways of using that nasty plot set. The third thing I want to mention is that Swoobat really benefits from the terrain seeds, so things like Psychic Seed or the Grassy Seed. We saw that kind of used in some battles in Pokemon Sun and Moon, but Pokemon Sword and Shield is even more viable because Swoobat can set up its own terrains. That's because it gets Grass and Psychic type moves, and when it Dynamaxes, you can go for Max Mindstorm, which sets up Psychic terrain. If you're holding the Psychic Seed, you boost your special defense by two stages. Equally, if you're running Energy Ball, you can go for that Max Overgrowth, holding the Grassy Seed, that will boost your defense by two stages. Obviously the simple is giving you that extra boost, making you bulkier and more able to survive. And if you do last your Dynamax turns, then those boosts will help to boost your stored power power as well. But that's not all. Dynamax is basically a buff for Swoobat, even if a different Pokemon Dynamaxes, because now so many other things can also set up terrains. Terrains are just more prevalent because of the Dynamax capabilities, so the seeds are a great item to run with Swoobat. So those are three ways of doing it. So you've got Nasty Plot, you've got 
Dynamaxing with the Max Airstream and you've got holding a seed instead of a focus sash. The last thing I want to mention is something I've already alluded to in a previous video, which was my Alchemy video, which is Decorate and Swoobat. So Decorate is Alchemy's signature move. When you target a Pokemon, you'll raise their attack and special attack by two stages. With Swoobat, which now has access to the simple ability, you're boosting its attack and special attack by four stages. You get that ridiculously high special attack stat and eight boosts in one turn. So in that one turn, you immediately take your stored power's power to 180. Way more powerful than any max move. That is so insane. So what I like doing is giving my Alchemy a Choice Scarf, guaranteeing that it will outspeed my Swoobat on the first turn. And on the first turn, I can just go for a Decorate and a Stored Power into one of my opponents in doubles battles, and you will almost always get a KO. Just having the special attack boost is great. You can go for your Heat Waves to get nice spread damage too, or even Dynamax to get your Max Airstreams going off. But Decorate and Swoobat is a match made in heaven. Now this Pokemon is still really frail and in doubles battles that is a big issue. You really need to watch out for things like Fake Out and um, like Sand and Hail because Focus Sash is going to get broken quite easily. So bear that in mind. But when this works and when the ball gets rolling, Swoobat is just so satisfying to use. It's definitely a glass cannon, but it does so much damage with Nasty Plot and Stored Power or Decorate and Stored Power. Such a fun Pokemon to use. I definitely had to highlight it. So I hope I've inspired you guys to try it out. If you want to get your hands on a simple Woobat, then check out my Twitter. I'll tweet out details and hopefully some of you guys will be able to get one. If you enjoy the content, please consider subscribing to the channel and leaving a like. All that's left to be said is I've been Fu, you've been awesome, and hopefully see you next time. Goodbye.